gasoline and electric vehicles that share the same platform are nothing new, but until now, the compromise has usually rested on the EV side of the equation. That all changes, however, with this, the Mercedes-Benz Concept CLA class. It gives us a look at the company's upcoming MMA small car architecture, but most importantly, it will be an EV-first design with internal combustion variants coming later. It also makes liberal use of the Vision EQXX concept car sustainability technologies, making this one of the most carbon neutral vehicles that Mercedes has ever produced. And as if that's not enough for you, the CLA just looks phenomenal, like any good four-door coupe from the automaker should. Before we dig into what makes the CLA concept so special, please be sure to subscribe to the Inside EVs YouTube channel and find us on all of your favorite social media so that you can interact with us there. You can also find a link to the full debut post of the Concept CLA in the link in the description. The most obvious attraction to the CLA Concept is the styling. This is clearly a four-door coupe design from Mercedes-Benz, as all CLA class vehicles have been in the past. But as you can see, it has been modernized quite a bit. One of my favorite features, for example, are these sharp, bold, horizontal lines on the front and rear fenders that wrap around from the headlights and the taillights. Now, if you're looking close, you can see that there's also some illumination that bleeds into the chrome front and rear, giving this car kind of a disc or halo effect that I think looks absolutely fantastic and I desperately hope makes it to the production version. There are also lots of bold and surprising styling details. For example, the shark nose grille up front is far more aggressive than before, and it has more in common with the AMG GT and the SL than it does with Mercedes' other four-door products. There's also lots of negative space. For example, the step front end separates the grille from the headlights to give the car a little bit more geometric interest, and the Mercedes-Benz three-pointed star appears in both the head and tail light lighting signatures so that you always know what you're looking at even if it's nighttime. The Mercedes-Benz Concept CLA will take tons of inspiration from the EQXX insofar as its powertrain is concerned. Two different battery technologies will be available. Silicon oxide anodes will appear on flagship models for excellent energy density, while entry-level cars will get lithium ion phosphate anodes that should reduce cost while still providing good efficiency. Furthermore, the cell modules will be held in place with adhesive, not screws, reducing size, weight, cost, and manufacturing complexity. The Mercedes-Benz Concept CLA uses an 800-volt charging architecture with 250 kilowatt DC fast charging. Mercedes says that this car will add 248 miles of range in just 15 minutes on an appropriate fast charger. It also gets 466 miles of WLTP range, although that number should drop to about 380 miles if it's ever rated by the EPA. At the former number, however, Mercedes says that this car will go 5.2 miles per kilowatt hour, which is incredible efficiency for any electric car. As nice as those numbers are, sustainability is a huge factor of the Mercedes Concept CLA. For example, the electric drive unit makes use of much less rare earth metals than in previous generations. Furthermore, sustainable and plant-based interior materials will be available. For example, the Napa leather is tanned with coffee bean husks and recycled blue pet fabric appears on the console armrest. Artificial silk grown in a lab is used on the door panel accents and bamboo appears on the floor mats. Finally, and in the most interesting use of materials on this car, cellulose-based paper trim shows up on the center console and door handles, and it feels very robust. While we're talking about sustainable interior materials, let's have a quick conversation about cabin design. This is an extremely tech-forward design. There's lots of shimmering blue and red on the center console. The Napa leather is tinted silver. It's just really bold and exciting to look at. One of my favorite design features is this laurel wreath motif that you see on the door panels and the seat centers. Now, if you squint, you can tell that that's actually an upsized version of the laurel wreath that appears on the traditional Mercedes-Benz star. Also, very, very cool is the fact that the full glass roof has little Mercedes-Benz stars all throughout, and they cast shadows on the seats and door panels. It's kind of a reverse, tiny little stars and a big old laurel wreath. I love it, and I think it looks very cool. There's also tons of technology on board because the Mercedes-Benz MMA architecture is going to be the first that makes use of the company's new MBOS operating system. Now that uses a liquid-cooled processor mounted down at my feet, and it powers this full-width super screen that has three separate screens combined under one single sheet of glass. Now what that means is very advanced gaming engine graphics with excellent response and animations. We saw that in the Vision EQXX the last time we drove it, and to see it in a production intent concept car is very exciting. 
There are also some other clever details found in this cabin. For example, the HVAC vents are actually mounted above and below the screen instead of these big turbine looking things right here. These are actually how you adjust the HVAC controls. So it's really cool that you get physical controls within a very digital space. It's a lot of fun to look at. Some other very cool touches are the fact that you've got both a glass inductive charger right here on the center console, but furthermore, there are magnetic coils mounted in the seats so that when you jump in and just throw your phone down, it will charge right there next to you on the seat. As its name suggests, the Mercedes-Benz Concept CLA class has some work to do before it's ready for prime time. But the company says that the first MMA platform vehicles will be on the road by the end of 2024. The CLA will likely come first, followed by a shooting brake and two SUVs, likely the GLA and the GLB. It's not totally clear how much technology will make the leap from concept to production, but one thing is assured, these cars will be far more energy conscious and efficient than their predecessors. And regardless, I hope not much changes about this car because I think it looks fantastic. Concept cars are meant to stoke the imagination and get you excited for the future, and that's exactly what this one does. I can't wait to slip behind the wheel and go for a drive, so hopefully it comes sooner than later. Thanks for watching.